Hey, what's going on, my name is Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Golden Sun. Last time we made it to Lumpa, and I did not expect to actually be able to enter the town, but guess what? We can! Uh, we explored the town. By the way, this is really cool. I like how they have their houses and like these little... Um, they, they live in like the hills, which is kind of cool. They're like hobbits. <laughs> They're like leal hobbits. Let's try to go to Lumpa Fortress. Hello! Let's come any closer to the fortress. How could Zorompa be so devious? I can't believe that he's the son of Dompa. Even a mouse could enter this fortress while I'm on watch. Got to be a shadow to sneak past me. A uh, shadow, eh? Interesting. Dompa is a genius, not releasing hammer. So smart, so it's a great way to use hammer to keep extorting money from Kui. So it seems some people are on Dompa's side, and some people seem to are on Dompa's side, I should say, and some people really want to just leave. So, hint here, if you walk past the middle here, they'll start to run away, but maybe we could just... Past. Ah! Ah! Don't come any closer to that fortress, dang it. Let's go from the other side. Uh, you don't see me! Gotta, gotta inch away. Inch worm. Wow, I actually thought I was gonna make it there for a second. <laughs> so, no matter, try as hard as you want, there's actually no way to get back there currently. Um, you did get a hint, something about a shadow, uh, but nothing we can do for now. So, it's time for us to take our leave. Uh, ooh, okay. Just because Ivan is low on synergy. I mean, not really, but it's, there's a synergy stone right here. Might as well make use of it. So that's why there's a synergy stone here instead of just being able to sleep at the end. Oh, that's cool. That's why that's there. So you can see that there's a little sparkle sparkle up there if you use reveal. It's just the right spot. Cool. Um, there's no enemies to fight in here, by the way, in case you're wondering. Also, the textures they use here is really weird. They kind of intersect. You can see like this big square of texture with the switch here, and it doesn't really work very well. This cave, it's kind of gross looking. Anyways, if you hit that switch, it opens it. And this is why I did not want to hit the switch earlier, because it completely closes and covers the puddle. The gate is slightly open, which is weird. You would think they wouldn't do that, but yeah. Anyways, now I brought this up last episode. Uh, we should actually use. Let's start using these sacred feathers just to get rid of them. Um, the world. Now that you have the ability to come back through here and you can go through the world normally again, there are a few things that have changed. Like I said, most notably in Zion and um, Fusion Temple. So we're gonna go over there and talk to those people that are relevant. <laughs> I am not gonna show the chip, although there have been a lot of shortcuts. That will be unlocked to us. Like we don't actually have to go through Goma Cave anymore. There's like a shortcut through it all and all that, which we actually activated the last time we came through. But still, it's a quite a long trip. We'll probably take like 50 minutes to get all the way around to our first stop, which would be Fusion Temple. So I'm not gonna show that. Um, I will see you guys in a bit. I'm already here. I might as well kind of show the shortcut I'm talking about specifically for Goma Cave. Is we had we had this rock we could walk on before, but there's another rock. That rock there that we pushed down before. You recall at the very end of the cave. But alright, without further ado, I will talk to you guys in a bit. Let's make it to our first stop, Fusion Temple. Bye! Alright, that actually only took like three or four minutes. That didn't take any time at all. Do you know the floor? Oh, you say you'll sit. So I think I actually did not get to test this on my other file, so I'm hoping this actually works. Oh, it's still open. I thought it's closed once you leave. Proceed to the temple. We've already done that though. What is this alternate universe? Does, have things not changed here? Yes, it is noble of them. Hopefully... Oh no! This energy fine monster- god damn it, so this isn't- Huh. Alright, so we're actually gonna have to do this a second time then. Um, I didn't get to do this on my practice file because I skipped this to show you guys what happens in alternate minds when you don't bring forest with you. Something was supposed to have changed with Nyampa, but it has not yet. So I guess we'll have to come back here once we progress the story a little bit more. I don't know what point that is. I thought it was when uh, we could come back do uh, the same thing. I would activate like va veil and um, vault changing, but I guess not. In case you're wondering, if you talk to the other people in like villages like Bilibin and Kalima, nothing has changed with them. Take a feather. Of course, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> so in case you're wondering, like, oh, we should go check out what's going on over there. Um, all the text is the exact same for when we save the village, so there's not really a whole lot of points. But right now the more annoying part, we have to go through mobile first. This is really the only annoying dungeon we actually have to go through and there's no shortcut, so once again, I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright, that actually wasn't bad either. It's <laughs> surprising. So, everyone still will say the same thing here. Trouble lately, Sue is Master Faye's apprentice, who's chopping a- Oh, okay, well, I lied. <laughs> 
just got better, but they broke one leg. Could the rock still grow? It was very hard work. Perhaps the end of rock stay there. Caravan's gonna pass. The pressure's gonna come as the end. I'm assuming everyone else. You know, a few customers say these customers. Yeah, okay. So it seems most people do have the same text. I thought everyone had the same text, but apparently uh, some people don't. Make sure you just have it all at once. What is going on? I was happy to see gems falling in the sky. It was very strange. I guess these bad things are coming. I do not want to give these guys racist voices, obviously. I want to help move boulders. Now my back hurts. Some of you do not carry rocks. I thought they were cooperate. I was foolish. I guess we're going to come back here as soon as we, um, we uh, helped Sue when he was trapped, but I, I guess, you know, whatever. It's not a big deal. Sue's resting. Fizzy is watching over him. Thank you. I'll gladly see you. Miss Faye is very worried about these two. Hey, here they all are. One happy family. Fizzy's prediction came true, and I believe she can foresee things. It's about time, old man. Look at this. This is a weird face, man. It's like his jaws like pushed in. He has a weird nose. I don't know. Fezzi's ability to sense trouble is real. I'm quite surprised. Oh, warrior, welcome. Sue is saved thanks to you and Master Hama. And my deepest gratitude. Master Hama had uh, has great power. You do too, young warrior. You're both amazing. I was injured by by rocks on my way to Lama Temple. I'm sad my train cannot help me. Rip. I knew help would come when I was trapped. I must thank everyone. So, yep, we just walked all this way just for that. <laughs> to see, just to kind of resolve uh, that stuff there. Um, I didn't mention this when we were in Vault, and I know we're kind of very far from that already. Uh, you do want to talk to the mayor because that does affect future events, and what triggers that is talking to the mayor. Dang it, avoid. No, we need more of you. Alright, so, without further ado, once again. Oh yeah, the other dungeon you have to go through is uh, Lamakin Desert. That one sucks. Um, I'm... We're gonna have to go through... At least Silk Road's clear, so I'm gonna have to go through Alton. Ah, oh, man. Maybe Hammer has something new to say? I actually don't know about that one. Hmm. But yeah, so in order to affect future events, you, you do need to talk to the mayor. Uh, I think that's the only other thing that mattered, though. Yes, okay, I yeah, just... Tutorials for the deserts. Right, right, right. I haven't said anything else. The future holds many hardships, but you must not give up the good fights. This your future clearly must be because the I cannot be impartial to it or to you. <gasps> she loves me. Confirms. Um, anyways, I will see you guys once we are back at the clean docks. Alright! Alright, alright, alright. Welcome back to Calais Docks! It's time! It's time! Finally to set sail! Holy crap, it feels like forever since we've been here. But, yep. So, like I said, activate going down here. To activate the ship sailing, we gotta go down here. Let's save just to, you know, just in case. You never know. You want to save, gotcha. Let's go. Our replacements never arrived. Builder shot me after the same. When he says replacement, he's talking about the, sh the other ship. Just to, just to refresh here, it's been a while. Who are the sea monsters? Who's gonna be protecting us from the ship? That'll be me, Aranus, Sean, on deck, and. I said that really weird. Hey, it bugs me that there's not a fifth person to, for everyone to stand over there, you know? I used to get friends that we be taking you down here. Can we really depend on them? Dude, the pen's diapers are the best. I used to get friends have seen more comment than I ever have, so there's nothing to worry about. You see, so Kaja, we trust your judgment. Ooh, bad call. What will you do, and what will you do if anything becomes incapacitated to take to church out? I'm not sure, what happens then? Another passenger will help row the boat. Don't worry about it. I had a word with the passengers. <laughs> That's so stupid. We'll go and you give the order when the time comes. Hmm, good point. You should res res you should select a replacement and bring him here. Run requires teamwork. Be sure to balance the two teams. That is actually very important to know. That's right, if we're not balanced, we won't make much progress. Alright, you have your orders. I trust you'll do your best. Preparations ready! Ship score is clear! Yeah, in case there's a giant iceberg all of a sudden. There's this lucky anchor that vibrates. Oh, that's why he likes it so much. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, cast off, yar. That's actually not a power voice. 
Where are, where are all those autos? That's not the voice I gave them before. They're not really rode to the beat of the drums. Look at that, they're not even all going together. What is this crap? Here we go, you guys. Uh, yay, it's so much fun. If only we could control the book. Avast! I saw sparkles in the- uh oh Oh god, those things are big. Monster sighted! Monsters? Hi, Captain! Sea monsters! Captain, turn the rudder hard to starboard! How the heck could he hear them? Alright, I'm turning! No, you're not. You just stand there. It's no use, it's too late! <laughs> oh god. Arrgh! Well then. Monsters below deck! Well, we did a shitty job. Isaac, take care of these beasts and save my mates! So, this guy's straight up dead. You can't interact with him. You can't, uh, hold on. Let's put mind read and reveal back on. Cannot mind read him, he's just dead. <laughs> you don't do better a job for Dennis, I don't feel any worse myself. Yeah, I don't understand why Isaac's upstairs. Please just stay here and protect me. Far from monsters, this is your job. Hurry up and take care of him. Oops, did not use a reveal. If the sea monsters get us, we won't be able to keep rowing. Uh, curses! I want to smack the monster with my orb. But if my orb breaks, I won't be able to row. All this from deeper attacking, just as the captain feared. This guy's pooping his pants. Ooh, monsters from the deeper attacking, just as the captain feared. Wait, what? This is the same thing? Why don't you do anything to stop those monsters? I know, right? <laughs> I'm scared. Those monsters are terrifying. Mommy! Follow me, stop me, baby. Trembling, I'm trembling. I'm too scared. Go, you get him. Uh, if I weren't so tired, I'd beat those monsters down without breaking a sweat. All right, calm down there. Curse those beasts. They got their oars, man. Frank, see monsters for warriors. I want nothing to do with it. And that's what I thought. Who's that thing gonna grab next? Uh, we oarsmen may not be strong, we have no match for the sea monster, so we're just gonna ignore these guys for a second. Um... Oh! We can't go upstairs! No, I thought we could actually go upstairs. What are you doing? Go save those bees! I just like how you just- they're just standing there and we could just do whatever the heck. Ooh, we haven't shown Kite yet. So, these are Mana Wars. Uh, I've never seen these guys before. Eh, Flint. Um, hopefully... and we have not seen Kite use yet either. So let's use it, shall we? Uh, we'll use it with Mia. And then Miss, sure. So Mana Wars, they're level 17. They have 137 HP each, so they're not particularly strong. Um, they drop 120 gold, 87 experience points. They have the ability to use Banshee Howl, and they also have a 6.25% chance of dropping an elixir. Ah, it's read the wrong thing. Level 17, they have 137 hit points. That was right. 87 gold and 55 experience points. They have a 3.125% chance of dropping an antidote. They have the ability to use poison ink. So here, we'll go to Ivan and then Mia. So let's say, let's see, it's just Ice Horn, for example. Have we even seen Ice Horn yet? I'm not entirely really sure, actually. Just because just we, I don't think we've seen it yet. Ice Horn. And then we get the ability to attack again. So just to do something different here. Whatever you do first is what she should do first. There we go, and dead. And there's, there's that. Hey, we got the antidote after all. Hey, hey, are you okay? I, I, I'm bad with my voices. He's scarce voice. Looks like you took care of those sea monsters. I'm missing an oarsman. Yep, he's dead. He's straight up dead, man. Look at him. He's being dead on Oh no, he's unconscious. But you never actually see him again, so he's just dead. <laughs> uh, it looks like the sea monsters got one of our rowers. Yep. There's no way around it. Why is it going? Ask on the passengers are okay. No, I don't want to hop to it. All right. Um. So they were talking earlier about um having a balanced team. That is actually super important. Uh, let's go here first. I do want to like just talk to everyone real quick. I'm not gonna do this every time that something happens. I do want to do it once so. Perhaps not even everyone, just talk to some people. Orisman was injured? There's no time to worry, we must escape the waters of Karagol. We should probably just turn back to be honest with you. Or I should do a better job. We knew the risk when we set out. It always hurts to see a crewman get injured, yeah. Way to go, you failed your team, Captain. Captain Jack Sparrow! So sorry for the Orisman who are injured. Let's see, uh, no one's got hurt, okay, Isaac? Uh, when I look at the sea water, I get to feel sick. I don't know how I can fight in this condition. You must feel awfully important ordering people around like this. I'm a job you. I can't row. 
Rosemary was injured by a sea monster. I'm just glad I'm not, I'm not the one to take his place. Yeah, that one does kind of suck, doesn't it? Hello, guy who stole the thing before. Rosemary was injured, huh? No, no, I'm unlucky. I need to ask someone else. But I haven't seen some guys. I think what I think for. Okay, so I just want to show this real quick. See how the ships run? It kind of makes you dizzy, right? I do have the ability to fast forward in this game. Not normally an ability, but I have it thanks to the way I'm playing it. Watch, I don't know about you guys, but this makes me feel extremely sick. Are you ready for this? Does that make anyone else feel extremely sick? That makes me feel dizzy. I don't even get dizzy. I don't know, I discovered that when like practicing the game. Because I normally go fast forward through a lot of it, just to like, just to get the general gist of it. Uh, looks like another Ozman was injured. Another one? What? You have to pick up one of the was it, was another one injured? What? No idea when the sea monsters might attack again. Curses! I won't let them have their way with us any longer! Have their way with us, huh, senpai? Ship's crews, ready for anything? I'll be ready for you from Ask Others Row. Yeah, so this is the only guy you can't ask for. Everyone else in here, though, is fair game, including the old man. Ha, <laughs> really, right? Confused, cheese, whoever you like. What? Me? You must be joking, right? <gasps> if you don't fr oh my god. By the way, he phrased that. Phew, don't fight me like that. I thought I just told him I want him to roll. So there's actually an, an important order we're gonna need for people here. All those people, you're asking a frill man to roll? No. I thought I actually asked the tour guide to help me roll there for a second to scare me, because that's not the right guy. That's right, no one ever treats me. You mind read that if you want. Why am I getting worked up over this? There's no way he chooses to grab an old man like me, is there? <laughs> what? Oh no, you're gonna ask me to roll? No. But what? You're not gonna pick me, you're a really nice guy. Hey. This guy's been staring at me the whole trip, maybe he likes me? What?! I don't know who he's talking about when he says that, because he's facing this way. He's talking about the tour guy? But he's not really facing the tour guy, and tour guy's not really facing it. And I haven't been staring at him the whole trip, so it's like weird. No, you're gonna make me are you? No. He's a businessman. I'm not starting out to be of any use. It's no use, no one would choose me. After all, I'm the tour group's guy. Wait, me and Rosman? Give me a break, seriously? Ha! <sighs> Scary, your heart nearly stopped. How do you find it really entertaining, though? Please, 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 just don't let him choose me. That poor man, I feel sorry for him. What, you want me to take his place? Nope. Who's gonna be you guys? That's right, you can't ask a proper lady to do such a filthy job. What's wrong with you? Go ask the- go bother the man, why don't you tisk? Okay, don't tell me you're gonna ask a lady to row. No. Sorry, me, sir, don't frighten me like that. It was a tough job, isn't it? It's not for me. You- you must be joking, you want me to row? No. Yeah, besides, a spatula seems to be better than an oar. Especially it's kind of a baby or isn't it? Hey! Looks like they need someone to help her. Don't look over here! Hey, you don't think I'm making the orders, are you? Nope. So who's it gonna be, you guys? Heh heh. We made a smart choice, buddy. Oh, oh no, he's coming to ask me to row, isn't he? Well, he's actually correct. This is the guy we want to row for us. Grr, I can't believe the guy's actually choosing me. Saying such a manile work as a proud person like me is going too far. And then if you've talked to anyone after that, hey guys, you got a good eye! And then if you minor, I'm not gonna minor everyone. Okay, now watch out to make eye contact, turn the other way, they'll have different text. Oh, is that person gonna guess the me? Everyone's like super relieved. Let's move right along with that person. <laughs> we chose a thing, could have been me. <laughs> oh no. When our eyes met, I thought it was me. Looks like you're gonna help me choose a row, so get on with the rolling. Make me nervous stand and look for an oarsman. Okay, I lie, I guess I'm gonna talk to him again. Choose an oarsman! Okay, after this though, I'm not gonna do this again. Stick by this time. What about next time? Oops. Chosen Oarsman, I know that's an honor, is it now? Well, that's where he's gonna let anyone off. That's not me. I mean, you know, it's a warrior. That does make the most sense to grab this guy first. Haha, -ha, chosen to be an Oarsman, huh? <laughs> I ran a cold set thinking I was gonna choose me. <laughs> you finally think so, did you? Show your stuff! That was first half, looks sad enough to break out in tears right here. Okay, so yes, this Swordsman is who you want first. So they were talking about balancing before. If you choose an unbalanced team, Things might happen really. Isaac, get back! And you brought Norseman with you. Oh, you're gonna have a role for us. All right, take your place. No, we'll need you to protect this area again, Isaac. Preparations ready. Why couldn't Casher just say that, or shout it up the stairs or something? You know. Why do you have to come up here just to nod someone? Ship score is clear! Alright, we're off! Roll those oars! Yay! So, yeah. There is a secret here. If you choose an unbalanced team, 
you'll actually get to an entirely new location that we will be exploring very far off in the future. Oh, that's not far, but far off into the future. And, um... Yeah, we just got to go there early and explore some cool stuff and get some cool stuff and stuff and stuff. So that's what we're going to be trying to do here. These seagulls are distracting this guy. Monsters! So I guess what happened here is the seagulls are distracting this guy. Nice job, man. Nice job, crow's nest, dude. Hey, keys! I mean bats! Wait a minute! Those keys attacking Orianus are facing the wrong way! Actually, the ones attacking Sean are also facing the wrong way! What the heck, man? That's weird, I never noticed that for ARG! Monsters below deck! So, Isaac, take care of these beasts and save my mates! So, considering this guy's on the ground there. This is bad and starting to prick up here. Yeah, I'm not afraid one bit of the monsters, one bit of monsters, one bit of the worry. The sea monsters look awfully strong. I'd rather be an oarsman and have to fight them. Wow. So the warrior himself is horrified of these guys. So yeah, there's a bit of a pattern going on here. Oh, I should have paused the episode there, actually. Lizard fighter appeared! Rabbit bat appeared! Okay, so these guys... Oh, the rabbit bats! Right, right, right. Okay, so the rabbit bats... Wow. Huh. At level 17, it's weird, because I have the rabbit bats listed first, even though, you know, that you don't see them till here. Uh, well, here. First we'll get everyone's attack. Good to go here. Sweet. Um... Rabbit Bats, level 17, have 125 hit points each, uh, have 82 gold, and 61 experience points. They have a 6.25% chance of dropping a sleep bomb. They give you Sonic Wave, which can paralyze you, Vampire Crying, which can steal health from you, um, and heals them. Oh, uh, wait, really? Heals? Oh, right, right. Nope, that's actually correct. Sorry, my, my own notes confused me. That happens a lot, it appears. And this guy, a Lizard Fighter, a Lizard Fighter. Alright, that's everything. Alright, Nuri, there we go. And this guy, what is he? A lizard fighter. He is level 17, has 212 hit points, so a little bit stronger. He drops 124 gold, 89 experience points. He has a 6.25% chance of dropping a nut. I really confused myself because it looked like my U is an A. <laughs> and he also has abilities water blessing, which is a strong move. And lizard, other lizard fighters have fought in the past. Other lizard men who fought in the past. Lizard men, not lizard fighters, that uh, could also use that. Hey, are you okay? Are you okay, matey, matey, matey? Looks like you took care of those sea monsters. We're missing an oarsman. Oh no, he's unconscious. Looks like the sea monsters got one of our rowers. There's no way around it. Hey, said go and get one of the passengers to row. All right, hop to it. So, yeah, like I said, everyone's gonna say the same text, so I'm not gonna do it again. Um, we'll do this next episode though. Thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And the next one, we'll uh, choose someone else to row and um, make progress towards getting to the secret place I was talking about. Bye bye!